Hello guys and welcome to another Premiere Pro tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create the HDR effect in Premiere Pro. The HDR stands for High Dynamic Range and is a measurement of the range of luminosity present in a photo or a video. A high dynamic range will make images brighter and colors more vibrant. To create this, first of all, you are going to need a high quality video. So images and videos shot with a mobile phone will not work best for this effect. It's best to use a DSLR. The first way to create this effect will be to duplicate your clip. So you hold on to your clip over here and hold on to Alt and drag it one step up to duplicate it. Now select the top clip over here and move over to your effects tab and search for the black and white effect. While selecting your top clip here, double click the black and white to apply it onto your clip. Next you search for the Gaussian blur effect and once again you double click it to apply it onto your clip. And lastly you are going to search for the invert effect and double click it once again to apply it. Now move over to your effects control panel over here and under your blend mode you set it to overlay. And under your Gaussian blur, you increase your blurriness to whatever it works best with your video. I'm going to set mine to 120 and I'm going to select repeat edge pixel. Now you can see what we have over here. If I should disable this top clip, you can see what we initially had and now you can see what we have. So what it has done is it has increased the brightness and the vibrance of the color of this video over here. The second way to do this, let me delete this first clip over here. The second way to do this is to select your clip and move over to your Lumetri color. Under your white balance, you are going to increase the shadow of your clip until the darkness disappears but not too much that it begins to fade the entire clip. Next you go over to your highlights and you will reduce the highlights but not too much that it begins to blur the clip. And also you increase the whites, I'm setting mine to 27 and you increase your exposure also depending on your clip. I'm going to set mine to 0.6 and now you can see what we have created. If I should off my lumetric color over here, you can see what we initially had and now when I switch it on you can see what we have now. And that's it guys on how to create the HDR effect in Premiere Pro. I hope you found this tutorial very useful. If you did, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Thank you and see you guys in my next video.